Hello my friends and welcome to the channel. I am Nani and I say welcome, comment, like and subscribe. Today, after some different things, uh, the BBX subscription and later I will tell you, later uh, I mean in another video, I will tell you how it's going. Uh, we have been at the lake, uh, we are the sailing boat, our RC one meter international class. Wonderful day, fantastic, uh, good wind. Uh, you have seen the video perhaps, if you haven't seen, go to the channel, look, uh, you will find it. And today we return uh, in the cave, uh, in the little workshop, and uh, we continue the assembling of this wonderful, wonderful car. Uh, the, the body is uh, uh, the, the, the Subaru, I will show you a picture. And the frame is a super technical frame. Today we continue the assembling with uh, step 14. And uh, these are all the pieces. Uh, to me, this is a new way to mount uh, the suspension arms. Uh, these are the lower one and uh, the rear. Uh, so we have to mount here in this position between... The Bang! I lost a piece, I lost a piece! Here it is! So, oh, start working! And step 14 is done. Pay a great attention on the exact orientation of the arms. Grease here, otherwise these skip away. It's impossible to mount. The grease keeps all the pieces together. And uh, here is a very important the position of this. Now, step 15, we have to mount on the chassis with these three pieces. These are mounted. The only thing is that it's not so easy to put this piece. Uh, you have to force a little bit. Now, we have step 16 with these pieces if i'm not wrong let's do it also step 16 is done uh, the only thing is that here they say there's a shadow i don't like here they say to uh, drill a hole and uh, this hole must pass through this one not over because there you have to put this to stop this okay let's do step 17 very easy nothing special to do look at the beauty of this thing I love it and uh, it works fantastic, fantastic really. Now we have to go to work on this with the step 18. We uh, have to prepare the lower uh, suspension arms. I think that I will show you after step 19. Can you see it? Here it is. 19, yes. Something more mounted. Very interesting, this part. Okay. One thing I suggest you. To keep all these... Here we have two washers, two spacers, they are not washers, they are spacers. Plastic, metal, plastic. You see, I have used a little bit of grease, just a little bit. Otherwise, while you put this into this, it, 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 was, it could be terrible. Uh, you, you lose every piece. So, with a little bit of grease, and grease on your hands helps to, to pick up the pieces and... Okay? And so step 19 is made. Uh, 
This is the push rod. Don't tell to everyone, but the thing that I hate most to do are these. There's no tool that works with this. They say to use, uh, where is it? This one. Doesn't work. This is too thin, it's, it slips away, you can grip not, just by hands. With this, a little help, or this, but and uh, it takes a lot of time, strength. I hate to do this kind of things. Bam! This is the way. Another thing I want to say to you is the uh, evolution in uh, this kind of uh, uniballs. Now they used to do, to, to do this plus this plus this. And uh, now I'm able to mount them. But the first time it was strange to combine uh, the this with this, uh, too long, too short, and always put uh, this, metal on metal, that is better. Not the strength one, soft one, it's enough. Now we have to do step 20, and step 20 is uh, nice, a lot of things. If I find something special, I will tell you. These are made. I have used a little bit of grease there to keep the spacer in position and uh, a hole here, two millimeters grease on the spacer. Right, now, step 21. Pieces, let's go, we close the front. Everything is mounted and work pretty well. The steering. So we have completed the transmission. Next step are for the dampers, oil dampers. And uh, now I have to mount following the instructions for this one with the long. I'll show you briefly and give you some essential information. But uh, about dampers there are a lot of videos. I don't think it's so interesting. These are all the pieces for dampers. And uh, you have to notice uh, that the front dampers have the shaft way much longer because we have to put also this. And in the instruction you have IFS, remember this, pay attention. Filling with oil is important to do this. Tension. Move the piston up and down to get all the air come out. Then place here and wait. Uh, the bubble came out. Then you fill again and close. Done. The spacers for the springs I will mount later. First I want to see how is a uh, the high of the car, how do they work, then I decide which kind of spacer to put. Now we have to mount on the car. First the rear one, step 24. And for step 24 these are all the pieces we need. Rear dampers are on and they work absolutely well. Not pretty, but absolutely well. And uh, I mounted also the front one, very easy. Two screws here and two uniball here over. And uh, this is 
fantastic it works perfectly uh, about spacer I, I, I left a little bit of play in the springs uh, so when I put the car down the, the the wheels came a little bit into the body and uh, thin and uh, rear medium then we have to check now next step very interesting this we have to do the tensioner for the belt here and we mount the motor about the motor i've chosen this one i think is good and uh, okay we have instructions for the carbon very interesting this is a wonderful way and this is the engine uh, it doesn't has very nice cables they are thin hard if i find something perhaps i will change them lightly tuned yes it's not so strong so but uh, the color the color was perfect blue and black so keep on going with this wonderful wonderful car i love it it's uh, well tamia made something no uh, this one perhaps there's an option part with these bolts here in the swivel bars i want them mount the engine wires are very short as usual the engine is on and i left a little play a minimum play between the teeth of the gears you see it just moves a little bit a little bit this is enough next step mount the esc and uh, as best as i can with shortest wires possible and for today we have finished now there's something i want to do but uh, i have to start this something then go away because it's very noisy and uh, it is uh, the braking we have to adapt everything but overall the carbon of the engine so i have a, a transformer three volts current I connect and for the very first time we can see the sound we, we can see and for the very first time we can hear the sound of this car of this mechanic fantastic And on this wonderful sound, it's not a noise. This is a sound. I thank you very much for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe. And uh, up to the next. Next, uh, the body, radio, and then we can go.
Ciao, 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 ciao. Or better. <laughs>